Sure. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about, this is an offset of culture, but it's, it's the regulations and laws. As we move into the commercial environment, one of the big challenges has been the, uh, the PII intent, integrity, yeah. how we preserve it or not, and where is it has to be preserved. So, for instance, for our training system, the question is, well, how are you going to register people into the training system? Is it going to be student ID? And then where do you keep all that other information in the DOD domain, and how do you link it together to make sure the training records are right? right. So this is a, one of the big issues. We have to get a policy for the PII. The, the other one is that we have, uh, the assumption here is we have network all the time. Now, Mike Noe is based on, you know, DCGS and his tactical cloud that you don't have network all the time. When we get to some of the outlying bases and whatever, or, you know, in the Pacific Rim where the, the cables are there and they depend upon the cables, we're going to have an issue at times if we go to a cloud structure, how we're going to actually communicate and keep everybody connected. So that disadvantaged user issue is, is a big issue as we move that way. Mm -hmm. I mean, the content is now, you know, keep it local, but that's not good enough for, you know, we're going to go to cloud get sure. the reliability and the cost savings out of it. Yeah, they're great points, especially that, that PI, I didn't think about that PII thing, but the ownership of data, and if something happens, who's liable and whatever, especially if you're going using commercial providers and things like that, that's a very interesting issue. And that gets back to the contracting issues of, yeah. you know, identification and, <coughs> and loss of information and everything else. Mm -hmm. So we're trying to work all those through, you know, to get together and figure out what's the best way of going forward, contractual-wise, bandwidth-wise, and Let's not forget cyber network defense-wise right. of how, right. you know, Cybercom wants to uh, be able to go and stop malicious activities right. in a pro commercial provider cloud. Yeah. How is that going to work? Yeah, right, right. 